All this season, Rob Chappell over at Originator Custom Motorcycles has been working on our FZ7 project bike. Yep, in just a month and a half, he's taken a brand new FZ7, stripped it of his angular bodywork, rear tailpiece and saddle. He's also tossed the fork, the headlight module, the stock pipe and the lighting system. And more recently, he's remolded the five-piece gas tank and painted the frame. It's pretty amazing what he's done in just a very short period of time. And now we're in the home stretch as the motorcycle has to be ready for the consumer show circuit in just two weeks. Let's look in on them now. Well, Rob, we're down to the last two weeks in this FZ07 project and uh, the tank is back. It's white and ugh, it's ugly. <laughs> <laughs> the tank itself looks great, but I didn't expect to see it in white. No, this is just a, this is our fiberglass part. So my good friend, Steve Strutt, he makes all of my molds, so you saw last time when I was holding up the part. Right. I gave him that. We made a plug out of it. This is an actual fiberglass piece out of the out of that mold. Right. Um, as you can see, the shape's quite different from stock. Mm -hmm. So very like round, kind of flowing lines, a nice little flat top, um, and great knee indents is going to allow you to tuck into the bike, right? Right. So um, that integrated with the seat and tail rack is going to make the package what I envisioned it to be. White's a little stark, <laughs> you know. We're going for a darker kind of somber theme. Yeah. Uh, not so loud, um, but anyway, it'll be painted. Um, actually, going to paint tomorrow. So okay, yeah. So yeah, we've got two weeks to go. Um, we're in the final stages. This um, I remember this now. This was a you had to build like a mold for this. Yeah, right? that's right. Yeah. yeah. So I started with the stock tank as a base, just to kind of have my reference points, mm -hmm. um, and then started shaping it. It was a lot of work to to get it to where it was. But now that we've got it finished. Part I can continue to make these pieces uh, on an ongoing basis. You've done a rad cover as well, yeah, and you've absolutely. got your logo in there, but that's yeah. great. Tell me about this. So what would happen, you know, going off road and that sort of thing, what would invariably happen is you'll get stones kicked up off the front wheel, even with the fender. Mm -hmm. um, so because we're envisioning this bike going at least 40% off road, right. um, I wanted to make something that would protect the rad as well. So that's a full stainless steel uh, piece. Um, so I designed it all in cardboard first, was able to bring that into a CAD program uh, design it all, send it out to my stainless cutters. Mm -hmm. That's all laser cut. And then I bent it here and made sure everything fit well and away you go. So the front's got a really nice set of grooves in it which is keep the rocks out of the front of that rad which yeah. is, you know, as you know, is quite delicate. It looks great and it's, I can see it's all coming together. Any word yet from your brother on that, that saddle out in California? Uh, he actually just received the pan uh -huh. uh, yesterday. So I sent him in some renderings and said this is what I want in terms of upholstery. Um, and the stitching that I wanted to see on the tail. Yeah. So the seat will kind of flow in between. Um, and then matching that stainless front rad guard, I've got a stainless back rack that I built for the bike. So it's going to kind of integrate uh, quite nicely. So. Okay, so paint job tomorrow, saddle coming back from California, back rack, we're almost done. What will happen next when we come back to see you again? So ultimately what I want to see happen is uh, we want to get this bike out to Hindle for a final uh, dyno run. Right. Um, I've got a dyno jet uh, kit that I've ordered for the bike, so we're going to get that put on, mm -hmm. get the bike fully tuned, and make sure it goes as good as it looks. Well, I'm very excited. Maybe what we should do is meet you up at Hindle. Yeah. We'll do the That'd reveal awesome. there, we'll dyno it, and we'll have a final look there. Yeah, for sure. Cool. Okay, man, this is, this is looking so good. I can't. <laughs> Two more weeks. I can't yeah. wait. Cool. Great Thanks. job. All right.